Hi, it's Steve Israel again with the Buyer's Edge. Uh, just to talk a little bit about the home inspection process and how that really works. Um, you, once you've found a property that you're really interested in, uh, part of the contract process is oftentimes you know, the selection of a home inspector uh, to go out and to look at the property and to help you find all of the defects in the property. But in addition to that, part of their job is really to help you understand how the home operates, so how all the furnaces work and the thermostats and the filtering systems and the water, um, shut-off valves, you know, all the other different parts of the house that kind of come into play that you really need to understand. Um, and this goes for condominiums and other types of property too. So the home inspector is really a, an incredibly valuable part of the process. And so as a result, we're in, our interest is not in just seeing the deal get done. Our interest is, you know, and, and the way we've set up our entire business is to help protect the interest of the home buyer. So as an integral part of that process, we really want you to have the very best inspectors who are not afraid to call out the things that are really wrong with the property. We'd much rather see you walk away from a deal or fight hard to get you the best result from a credit from the seller or trying to get the seller to fix something than we would to have you buy a property that ultimately you're not happy with. So, uh, so we know a bunch of inspectors, but at the same time, we're not in bed with any of these people. So we want you, and we're perfectly happy for you to go outside of our list of home inspectors and find somebody who is highly recommended, and we would advise you to go to Angie's List or some consumer reporting service um, to try to find somebody who's really highly recommended. We have people who we believe do a good job too, uh, but again, you know, we, it's really an independent part of the process. We're happy to work with whoever you decide to work with, and we feel like the recommendations that we make are people who we think have a strong history in the, mar in the market that we work in, that they understand houses, and actually sometimes we even direct people or help direct you to a number of resources where you have the old house guys versus the new house guys. You know, the new house inspectors and the way that they do those inspections is a little different. It's a much more high tech and it may be somebody who has a little bit different angle. There are also some inspectors who are really, really tech savvy and have a lot of, uh, a lot of things that do a lot, do a lot of stuff about air filtration and penetration into the house. So they give you a real kind of, uh, a real read on the insulation quality of the windows and the doors and what's up in the attic. Uh, that might be different, you know, in an old house that can become an incredibly important part of the process. So, uh, home inspection is an important piece. Um, we think that we know a bunch of people that are very good at this. They're, the rates that different home inspectors charge can vary wildly. So, uh, so it's an important part of the process to talk about as you're looking at properties and sometimes try to understand how that works before you actually find the house that you want.